2007, the state of Minnesota enacted a law that on its face and as applied unconstitutionally interferes with North Dakota's energy production in violation of the Commerce Clause of the United States Constitution. The Next Generation Act, or the NGEA, is a law purportedly relating to global warming and greenhouse gas emissions. The NGEA imposes restrictions on carbon dioxide emissions from out-of-state energy sources as a purely symbolic gesture that could only have negligible impact toward actually achieving their stated purpose of reducing greenhouse gas on a global scale. Emissions. The Next Gen Act provides statewide power sector carbon dioxide uh, emissions to include carbon dioxide emitted from the generation of electricity imported from outside the state of Minnesota and consumed in Minnesota. So as implemented, the Next Gen Act has a chilling effect on the development of new large energy facilities or the expansion or refurbishing of existing power plants located outside the state of Minnesota. The law has direct and serious consequences for North Dakota, as I have outlined. Therefore, this morning I have filed a lawsuit in the Minnesota Federal District Court seeking to declare this enactment unconstitutional and seeking a permanent injunction against the state of Minnesota from enforcing this law as applied to North Dakota. The Next Gen's regulatory regime interjects Minnesota policy into North Dakota and in doing so burdens North Dakota's industries and disrupts interstate commerce. Um, we know that it takes eight to ten years to build a coal plant. We know that it takes four years to build a natural gas fired facility. We know that it takes two to three years to permit a wind farm. And the more knowledge, the more sense we have of what is going to be regulatory required, the better off we are in making decisions. These aren't cheap decisions we're making. Now you're saying, you know, what, what's the impact now? We're sitting here as North Dakota with tremendous energy development in the northwestern part of this state. And we've got to, as base electric, figure out how we're going to provide that power to our membership. We're sitting here debating what resource do we go after. I can't go to my board and suggest we're going to build another coal plant here because of what this law does to us. It's those types of things that we've got to get clarity on before we make billion dollars decisions.